Hello guys, you are welcome to Chris Control Automation. In today's video, we are going to continue the drive programming by controlling this drive in both forward and reverse using external push buttons. Drives receives negative digital signal or positive digital signal to operate. This particular drive receives negative digital signal to operate. So we are going to see how we are going to operate this particular drive. The drive has 10 volt output and then ground. We are going to use this ground to operate the drive. We will connect a cable at the ground. Then it goes to one side of the forward button. We are using the normally open. Then we tap from the same side. This cable goes to one side of the reverse button. We are using the normally open. Now we have forward and reverse buttons. We connect this red cable at the other side. We connect the yellow cable at the other side of the reverse button. We have control terminals X1, X2, X3, X4. We are going to use any two of these. The red cable from the forward push button will connect at X1. The yellow cable from the reverse button will connect at X2. We tap from the negative terminal on the drive to one side of the forward push button. We tap from the same place to one side of the reverse push button. The red cable comes from the other side of the forward push button. Then it connects at X1 terminal. The yellow cable comes from the other side of the reverse push button. Then it connects at terminal X2. This is the connection. Let's run the drive and program it. On this manual, we have P4 input terminals. P4.00 is X1 function selection. P4.01 is X2 function selection. We are going to use these two functions. Since we selected X1 and X2, 0 is no function, 1 is forward run, 2 is reverse run. We are going to choose this tool. So we go to P4.00 program, enter, we press enter. Now zero is blinking, meaning it is on zero. We are going to select one, forward run. Enter. P4.01, that is for the X2. We select two. Enter. Two. Enter. Now we are done with the X1 and X2 configurations. We are going to select the type of operation or control. We are going to select terminal control. On this diagram, we have command source. Zero is operation control. One is terminal control. So we are going to select P0.02 and choose terminal control one. P0.02 Enter Now it is already on 1 We press enter Go back We are done with everything It is time to operate the drive I am increasing the frequency To 30 30 Hz 
I am pressing on the forward button. Let's monitor the direction. When I take off my hand, it will go off. I'm going again. You see, direction is this way. I am pressing on the reverse button. So this is how we control the VFD in both forward and reverse directions. In the next video, we are going to look at how the motor would continue to operate when we release our hand from both buttons. This brings us to the end of this video. If today is the first time you're watching this channel, I will urge you that you subscribe to this channel. You will like the video, you share the video to your friends, you put down your comments. I'll see you in my next tutorials. Thank you.